Hello, my name is Rob Luther with ForceFlix.com, and I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the SH404SEF component for Joomla. This is a free component. If you don't have it, you can visit my website, ForceFlix.com, and uh, I have a link there that you can download it. Highly recommend you getting this component. What we're going to talk about right now is 404 errors. Uh, if you don't know what a 404 error is, is a page not found. So if somebody goes to your site um, and type in a page in the address bar up here, and that's that page doesn't exist on your site, you'll get a 404 error. So what this uh, one thing this extension does, or this component does, is record 404 errors. So you can see right now I have three, and I can actually look and see what those URLs are by going right into here. So we have paintballforum.html and paintball positions. This is old stuff that I had up on the site that I just kind of mess around with. This is my play site. So anyhow, I'm going to copy that URL because I don't want people to just get 404 errors. I want them to go to a relevant page on my site. So after I copy the URL, I come down here to view edit SEF URLs. Click on that. And really what you would do is you would pick the page in your site that is most relevant to the content. But because I have all Joomla stuff on here right now, uh, obviously none of that's relevant to Paintball. So all I do is I just pick one URL. Um, let's grab this one here. And then you see there's an alias list. Okay, uh, I have one URL in there already. So I'm going to go ahead and paste Paintball forum.html in there, delete the white space out, save it, now now that that's in my alias list, uh, if somebody types that URL in or visits that URL from a search engine if it was indexed, it should redirect us to the URL that we just put in there that we just assigned it to. So that works out perfect. Okay, so then you want to make sure that after you do that, um, go back to your control panel, go into your 404 logs, and you want to delete that out of there, just so you don't get it confused and forget that you already have that one redirected. And that's all there is to the uh, SH404SEF URL 404 log.